Hello, beautiful light filled souls. I'm excited about the summit, which is coming up this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday on my YouTube channel. I will be live with so many great speakers who are going to be talking about, of course, their near death experiences and after effects, but also what they've learned on this journey around ego, around how to take that wisdom from heaven and apply it to your lives, to help you transform what you want to transform, to help you manifest what you want to manifest. And I say that knowing <laughs> that that journey can be a challenging one. And what I am setting the attention for is that the wisdom and the connection and the beauty that these speakers share actually infiltrates into your life and you see a shift in an area that you're working on because I know that miracles can happen. I know that great healing can happen. And many times it's just being open to that flow of unconditional love, to just aligning yourself to being worthy, open, and in the flow of God taking care of you creator, divine consciousness, unconditional love, whatever you want to say, but that's kind of a basic way of shifting. You know, there's a lot of discussion around manifestation, but sometimes I don't know what the highest good is. And so turning it over to that greater power, to that flow of the perfect love that many of us experienced in the afterlife, you know, there was no problem in the presence of God. There was no issue. There was no fear. There was nothing to change. It was perfection. So perfection is unconditional love and freedom too. <laughs> so that uh, chain that we hold on to, whatever that issue might be, whether it's, you know, this life, health, money, relationship, whatever it may be, there's a lot of belief systems that we just hold on to with intensity. And in order to shift those areas, you need a consciousness greater than your own. You need a light that shifts the way your brain thinks about things. And, and it will not necessarily work out in exactly the way you want it to but work out better. And that's the, that's the beauty of this. So practical spirituality. What, why did I pick that theme? because I know people are busy and I know that there are a lot of people who consume a lot of spiritual material, but I want the material, the information, the energy to shift something in your brain. If you want more of a connection to your angels, then I want you to hear the message that opens up that channel for you. If you want a shift in a certain area of your life, I want you to take the energy of this live event and apply it to what you are working on. So one of the uh, questions I'm getting asked a lot is, uh, I live in Australia or England or uh, the Netherlands, and will this still be live on your channel? I'm gonna keep the link up. So the day of the event, just simply come to my channel, look for the live event and and follow what you want to follow and what you can that day. I'll post the list of speakers again. Also, I'll leave it live until the next day starts. So if you're in another time zone, then I want you to be able to see it. But when the next live starts, I want people watching the next day. And so um, that live link will not be available, but it will be available for purchase later. So if you don't have the money to purchase the link. I certainly appreciate any donations. Um, it's a lot of work. <laughs> I have some great helpers this year though, so I'm excited to promote other people's podcasts and channels and also just give them time to interview and ask a few questions and really give me a break because what I hold as an intention and what I've always held as an intention is that the spiritual community is not a competition. It's a knowing and it's a community. And that's why I've created this summit. And that's why I'm bringing in other podcasters because I'm not in competition with you. I'm in collaboration with you. I'm here to make us all a part of a fun event and, and give us inspiration and hope to continue these conversations in whatever way they may evolve and whatever way they may change. But 
I believe that the new earth and the new way of looking at this world is collaborating with like-minded people and really spreading greater love, greater hope, and greater peace to humanity and to the animals and to the earth, uh, that we're all connected and we are all energetically sensitive and so even though this year's theme is practical spirituality i always want that energy of unconditional love of all are welcome all are loved all are blessed here to flow through the conference so please join me and all the amazing guests that will be speaking and i am excited to announce the co-host who will be helping me on different days and i'm excited to get your questions if you look at the list of speakers and there's a burning question that you had for someone that was never answered anywhere please post that below i'll certainly look at this uh, before the live the the comments and uh, take note of your questions but you can always ask them in the live chat on the day of the event as well and the last 15 minutes of each talk will be dedicated to your questions. So thank you for your love and your support. May you be blessed.